Why are you telling me to back up recordings regularly? I did that yesterday. Anyway, hello everybody. Good morning. Welcome to uh, another very nice spring break day. Today is the 24th of uh, March. Did I say yesterday was the 23rd? Yesterday was the tw Or did I say yesterday was the 24th? Because yesterday was the 23rd. But anyway, the big thing that um, happened yesterday, I didn't talk about it, but uh, this vacuum has been basically sitting here for a while, because this is our old Org vacuum, and, uh, well, actually, this, this is our newer one, but it stops working, and my mom got fed up with it, and she actually was like, okay, we're going to get a new vacuum cleaner, so, as of yesterday, we now have this, this is a shark something or other, and, um, we needed it because we basically needed to vacuum the floors because it had been somewhere between three weeks and like two months since the last time we vacuumed the floor. And this is the vacuum. This is a gigantic vacuum, to uh, to say the least. And that's one of my biggest issues with it because I'm used to the Auric being very lightweight and it's a lot easier to transport around. Whereas this thing is uh, not anywhere near as light. It's very, very heavy. And it's got the canister and everything strapped to it. And it's a... It's a big thing to lug around, really. And, uh, we'll see how it runs. I used it to clean the floor up here, but, uh, I wound up having to take a break just because of how heavy it is. It's a, it's a big thing to be lugging around constantly, which is why it was kind of nice with the Auric. And then we have a, a canister back for the Auric that, you know, is also pretty light. So it was just like, oh, you just have one thing and then you go switch to the other, but... That's a big vacuum, honestly. That shark is really big and also really heavy. So, um, I guess we'll see how it turns out. But I was using it earlier, and it seemed to do a nice job. It's just, that, again, it's heavy. Hello, everyone, and welcome to what was uh, Thursday's vlog. Now is... Uh, well, officially Friday, but whatever. It's still going to be basically what I did on Thursday. And other than work on the vlogs, which which obviously happened a lot, because I got a pretty nice chunk of work done on the vlogs, I also was working over here on my narrative script, which uh, I need to present uh, basically a week from yesterday, or, well, now two days ago, seeing as it's now 1.44 in the morning. But, um, so I'm not ready to show this to you guys yet. I will be soon, but not quite yet. But uh, I will just say that I called this Robert Cop uh, for the moment. I hope that I'm not going too far across the line with this, but uh, from the point of a uh, you know a licensing parody thing, is it's supposed to be like a a parody of cop movies, like. The Naked Gun and RoboCop, which are basically already parodies, so we'll see what I can do with it. Uh, again, this has to be a short. It's got to be like less than five minutes, so uh, we'll see how it turns out. But I'm pretty happy with the way the plot is working out right now because I already I already wrote it down. I have notes for it, so uh, I'm actually writing it now, and uh, hopefully I'll be ready to show it to you guys tomorrow. Because again, I need to have this ready to present. I got uh, like four vlogs done today, but. Uh, the start of writing Robert Cop is uh, it's going to be an interesting one because I already have three people, all of whom have been on the vlog before, that uh, that want to appear in the film. So writing in three characters for that. So I think uh, I think we're going to be pretty set here because I have to film this, and this film, if it gets through, will be released at some point in like 12, 13 weeks from the time you were, well, probably even less from the time you're seeing this from basically now. So, uh, I've got work to do, essentially. Gotta get this done so I can start working on actually filming it. And it should be interesting, because all of these joke scripts to this point have basically just been, been throwaway scripts, but, but this one actually has the potential to come to life. Well, I guess they, they all do if I took them far enough, but, uh, like the one with the Titanic or the one with uh, the Giver 3.2. Um, those were those are nice joke scripts, but I don't really see them going anywhere. However, this basically has to go somewhere. So this will be kind of interesting because it will be kind of one of the first times that something I realistically write gets shot and, and edited, which is the point of narrative, which is why this is going to be fun. Because I'm, I'm writing my narrative. This is... 
this is what's happening. I mean, this is basically the one thing I have to get done over spring break, is to come up with an idea for and write most of my narrative. And uh, that's what this is. As I've now reworded that like probably literally ten times in the past minute. So I'm just going to go to bed and say see you guys tomorrow.